Once upon a time, Taylor Swift and Harry Styles were the short-lived IT Hollywood couple. But now, all these years later, Harry has a few things to say to his ex. And actually, it's kinda sweet. So let's take a trip down young lovers' memory lane. Swifties, you already know that Taylor and Harry dated for a short time in 2012. Just three months to be exact. And their pairing had the looks of the perfect Hollywood couple. She, a talented country singer on the start of breaking into pop, he, a sexy standout of the hugely successful boy band One Direction. But that relationship didn't last long. Why? Well, Harry says now there was too much pressure on the romance. Talking to the Rolling Stone in a new interview, the Signs of the Times singer said dating Taylor was awkward. Relationships are hard at any age, he said, and adding in that you don't really understand exactly how it works when you're 18, trying to navigate all that stuff didn't make it easier. I just wanted it to be a normal date. Though the relationship was short-lived, Taylor got some good material from their romance. Though she's never confirmed it, fans think two of her songs, Out of the Woods and Style, are about Harry. And if that's true, the One Direction singer is honored. I mean, I don't know if they're about me or not, but the issue is, she's so good. I write from my experiences, Harry says. Everybody does. I'm lucky if everything we went through together helped create those songs. That's what hits your heart. Coincidentally, fans think now that Harry Harry has written a song about Taylor, but Harry didn't confirm if his track Ever Since New York was about his ex. Either way, the singer still holds Taylor in the highest regards, even after their breakup. The Rolling Stone writer noted that while talking about Taylor, Harry was nervous as he praised her. They're great songs, he said. It's the most amazing unspoken dialogue ever. But when asked if there was anything he'd like to tell the singer now, Harry clammed up. Maybe this is where you could write down that I left he joked, but he finished with this. Certain things don't work out. In writing songs about stuff like that, you're celebrating the fact that it was powerful and made you feel something. So thank you. Oh, now I kinda want a Haler reunion, don't you? That interview literally gave me all the feels. Now, tell me what you think though. Are there still some feelings left between these two? Let me know in the comment section down below. For more entertainment news, click the boxes and be sure to subscribe to Holly Scoop.